Uh, Rezatungin is a new drug and uh, in, in the uh, phase three uh, development and uh, uh, exceptional pharmacokinetic properties exist. It means that practically we are, uh, we give once weekly and uh, we reach high drug concentration in the blood, in uh, pleural fluid, in the abdominal cavity, in uh, uh, internal organs. Why is it important? Because uh, Fungal pathogens exist not only in the blood, but also in different body sites, including kidneys, spleen, liver, and we should eradicate uh, with this drug. Uh, and, uh, the previously mentioned echinocondines may not uh, penetrate well into different body sites, including pleural uh, cavity, abdominal cavity, thus they are not able to eradicate these pathogens for example, Candida albicans, the most frequently isolated species, Candida glabrata, Candida parapsilosis. Advantage for this new drug that uh, it will produce very high drug concentration immediately, not uh, one or two days later. No, there is no need loading dose, for example, and uh, for a week continuously very high drug concentration will be present. In the practice it means that uh, immediately start the killing of the fungal pathogens, thus patients will not die. Uh, for this reason, uh, uh, they will, uh, mortality rate will be decreased and uh, patients uh, will, will uh, not, uh, surviving rate will be significantly higher uh, during, uh, due to this new antifungal drug. Uh, Rezafungin looks a very uh, uh, good antifungal agent because it is effective uh, not only common but uncommon uh, candidate species as well. We work uh, with this uh, drug uh, not only against uh, common candida species but also against uh, uncommon candida species. Why is it important? Because uh, many of uncommon candida species are polyresistant. For example, one or two antifungal uh, classes non-effective against this uh, candida species. Uh, for this reason, we should uh, treat these patients with maybe different mode with new drug in order to survive the severe basic disease coupled with, uh, for example, candida and other bacterial infections. Uh, because no data about rezafungin activity against rare uh, uncommon candida species, we perform experiments uh, determine the efficacy of this drug against rare candida species. For example, candida guillermondii, candida lusitanii, candida kefir, Saccharomyces cerevisiae, uh, uh, this is the baker's yeast, uh, Candida fabiani. We, do, we did these experiments and we noticed very, very uh, good in vitro activity of Rezafungin against this rarely isolated Candida species. As I mentioned, this rarely uh, isolated Candida species may produce up to 70-80% mortality rate. Uh, very important that uh, Rezafungin activity was uh, comparable to previously uh, discovered, introduced Caspofungin, Micafungin and Anidulafungin. For this reason, uh, uh, we can use in the next, in the future, the uh, Rezafungin as well for the treatment of uh, invasive Candida infections, not only uh, Caspofungin, Micafungin and Anidulafungin. Uh, this uh, exceptional good pharmacokinetic properties practically life-saving. Uh, immediately uh, Rezafungin is able to kill the pathogen in our body and uh, very important that many patients uh, uh, who uh, should be stay in the hospital we can treat uh, after one or two weeks treatment as outpatient. So Rezafungin is a very good drug because it is usable for patients as uh, usable as for outpatients. There is no need to stay in the hospital for many many days. These patients we can decrease the the catheter associated infections for example we are uh, able to uh, uh, treat the patient uh, uh, probably we may reach a better clinical outcome because no need staying in the hospital if uh, the patient will at home catheter related infections and other nosocomial infections will be significantly decreased. This is good for patients and this is good for clinicians as well and it's maybe cost effective.